The beauty of life is that, what goes around, does come around for sure. Ye was right about Balenciaga. If that's not the title this video then I don't know what the title is, but more or less, I'm trying to shed light at the fact that what Ye says, or rather has been saying, has always been true. Black people are racially discriminated against. So for those of you that did not know, I will start it from the very beginning. And by that I mean, the very recent beginning of the whole Kanye West cancellation. Ye was cancelled by Balenciaga, Adidas, Gap, a lot of other celebrities, even woke babies just being weaned were out here cancelling him. They cancelled him because they felt what he said was wrong. And not only that, but they cancelled Kyrie for sharing a post, and many other black men have been cancelled in the recent past for fairly questionable behavior. I am convinced that if Balenciaga was a black-owned company, everybody would have cut ties with it by now. The entire corporate world would have cancelled Balenciaga. But that is currently not the case. For those of you that did not know, what happened is that, Balenciaga shared their latest photoshoot for Summer 23 or something like that. In those photos they had court documents about crimes against children. Not only that, but they also had a child holding a doll, while the doll was bound in some very questionable ropes. Some Fifty Shades of Grey type of thing. Ladies and gentlemen when Balenciaga got called out for this, do you know what the response was? They came out with very half-hearted, not apology, claiming they were unaware of what was going on. What's funny to me is you can literally see the child holding a Fifty Shades type teddy bear. So what could Balenciaga not see that the entire world could see? Even before the zooming in on the papers began, the teddy bear alone was a cause for concern. Whether or not this was truly a mistake from Balenciaga, we can't really know. I don't know why anyone in their right mind would take such a collection of photos. Because aside from that teddy bear, and the court documents, the name that was on the table in some of these photos, is the name of an artist that painted pictures of children being cut, part by part, or something in those lines. He more or less painted pictures of children with body parts around them. And yet Balenciaga let all these subtle things just get away. The level of detail at these atrocities was extremely high. And what I think is, it's only right for the entire world to do to Balenciaga what they've been doing to Kyrie Irving, and yay. If anything I think what Kyrie Irving did is significantly less than what Balenciaga has done. And so it will be very interesting to see if everybody will stand up against them how they stood up against Kyrie. You guys can comment your takes in the comment section down below. Thank you so much for watching and peace.